Hello YouTube, today we'll be looking at mouse and keyboard hijacking using the Flipper Zero. This attack specifically targets NRF 2.4 GHz radio chipsets built in most Logitech mouse and keyboards. Most wireless mouse and keyboards using Bluetooth or one such as Dell on TechNet or other manufacturers may not work. If anyone has had any luck with any other brands, I would love to see in the comments section. What the mouse jacker does is allows you to send ducky scripts to your computer. Ducky scripts are basically coded mouse and keyboard actions sent to your computer. In order to use Mouse Jacker, you will need a NRF 2.4 radio attached to your flipper. You can find the 2.4 sniffer and Mouse Jacker by going to Apps, GPIO, scroll down past Mayhem, Then we'll open Sniffer. In the Sniffer app, you'll also have two options here. You'll have um, an option to change the transfer rate from one megabit per second to two. You also have the option to change the sample time. You may want to adjust your sample time depending on the situation. The default is 5500 milliseconds. If you're trying to capture a mouse with very few movements, you may want to turn your sample time up, maybe to around 1300 milliseconds or 14,000 milliseconds. If you're trying to capture a mouse that moves very often, then you need to change your sample rate to a lower rate. Therefore, you'll scan quicker. Alright, so let's try to capture this mouse here. We've set our sample time to 7,500 milliseconds. Now when your flipper picks up the signal, it'll make a ding. Looks like we found our signal on channel 6. You'll know when it's found the signal because it'll show found and unique 1. When your flipper finds the signal, it will save your address for the mouse to the addresses.txt file. This file can be found under apps data. Scroll down. NRF 2.4 sniv addresses.txt. Now you won't need to do anything with that file. It's just there in case you want to delete it later on if you want to run a new scan. Remove your list of acquired wireless mouse and keyboards. This can be found under Apps, GPIO, scroll down past Mayhem. Then click on Mouse Jacker. Now it looks like we have our mouse's address here. Now we can load our ducky scripts. I have a fun little script here that I'm going to run on my computer. I'll show it again in case you missed it. Mouse Jacker app, open my script, my reprogram ducky script. Now if you don't have an NRF 2.4 module, you can still use the bad USB option on your flipper using a USB cable. 
I will also be sharing my Rickroll script in the description of the video.